Hi, I'm Melissa Colazzo and I'm talking to Sound of Series. Ooh, it's it's a wild ride. And even if you have read the book, there's a lot of surprises. So expect the unexpected. Yeah. It's definitely a little bit scary. I think adapting anything just because anyone who's already familiar with the previous piece of work um, is obviously gonna have judgments on the show, but I think we got really lucky in that all the creatives involved, all the producers and writers, like they truly love the book a lot. And the author, Karen McManus, um, was like a consulting producer and like sent the producers um, a list of moments that she wanted to make sure would make it into the show. And like, she got to see everyone's like audition tapes. And like, overall, I, I believe that she's very pleased with the adaptation, which is which is what matters because it's it's her baby. So it's a little scary, but it was it was great. Oh yes, I have. I read it um, after I got the part. Uh, just to familiarize myself with Maeve as much as I could. And it was it was a great help in understanding kind of everything. And did you like it? Oh, I loved it. It's I couldn't put it down. Like I finished it in two nights. I had to stop because my eyes were like closing on me. So I had to stop to go to sleep. But the second that I woke up, I finished it. I think I am similar to Maeve in a lot of ways, but also quite different just because she has been through a lot of things that I never have, but like probably out of all the characters, I feel like I'm the closest to Maeve with maybe like a little bit of Bronwyn and a little bit of like Janae maybe. I mean, playing Maeve was was wonderful. I feel like in the first book, which is what we're adapting the season, because we started, um, the show started being made before the second book came out. So we didn't really know where the story was going to go with Maeve. So we were just working off of Maeve in the first book. And there's not a lot of her in the first book. So it kind of gave us this freedom to sort of like create her from the ground up almost, which was really fun. So playing her, was just the best because like the writers like truly found so many new layers to her that like it was a little bit scary to approach because just seeing her circumstances and everything she's been through having to sort of like play that it was definitely a challenge but she's I mean she's just such a complex beautiful character that like it was it was an honor to be able to play Maeve yeah. Oh, absolutely. I'd love to see a season two. I think I think with the direction that the show's going in, I can definitely see a season two happening. So fingers crossed for that. Gosh. Mm. I just, I can't give any spoilers, but it truly could go in so many different directions that like, For me, season one was just so fun because Maeve is just very, she just kind of, every time she shows up on screen, I feel like she just causes a lot of chaos. And like, as an actor, it's so fun to be able to play a character that's just absolutely chaotic and a little bit unpredictable and sort of like in a, in a gray area of, I guess, like what side she's on sort of, even though she's like ride or die for Bronwyn. So I think maybe just like, All I can hope for is like, I hope they let me keep having as much fun as I had in season one, just being chaos. Oh, I mean, she's she was absolutely wonderful. She She's an actress. She's been an actress for a long time. So being able to work with a director who's also an actor is such a privilege because they they know how to speak your language in such a beautiful way. And she had such a specific vision, like from like the get go that it was like, it was wonderful because she truly built 
the like look of it from the ground up and I think the pilot is so I mean the whole show but the pilot is just so gorgeous and she really set the standard for like the look of the show and she was just yeah she was such a pleasure to work with that's really difficult but probably right now I think that my dream like directors would have to be either Alfonso Cuaron or Paul Thomas Anderson Probably, I mean, I think my favorite, like my favorite TV show, and it has been for a while, is Succession. I feel like that would be so much fun to be on.